What's up, everybody? My name is Mr. Fragrance. I'm back with another fragrance review. If it's your first time to this channel, welcome. I do men's fragrance reviews, unboxings, and free giveaways on Decan fragrances. So you see this gimmick here, it's kind of weird, but it's almost 4th of July. And I know like most people, they want to smell good on 4th of July. I got six fragrances that you're going to need to stay cool in the 4th of July weather. So stay tuned. Before we start this video, I'd like to say happy 4th of July to everybody out there, the troops, family, friends. Hope you have a nice 4th of July. So before we start this video, I'd like to say, Mr. Siaj, I'm hashtagging you, man. 4th of July fragrances 2018. Let's go. Nah, just playing with you, man. So today we're going to be talking about the top six 4th of July fragrances. There's a lot of fragrances you can pick from. There's a lot that I should have put on the list, but I don't want to make the video too long and 4th of July is right around the corner. So maybe if you want to smell good for the 4th of July or get compliments, these fragrances are for you. So stay tuned. So my number six 4th of July fragrance. This is a great fragrance from the house of John Verbatos. If you don't know what it is already, you should know pretty soon. I have a video below if you want to watch that video of it. And it's just John Verbatos, Artisan Pure. Arsene Pure is a great fragrance. You can't go wrong with this fragrance here, ladies and gentlemen. It has notes of white floral, mandarin orange, woody notes. It's just amazing fragrance for the summertime, spring, summer, fresh fragrance. Just, just a blast of nice citrus, clean, fresh. It's great for outdoor weather. You can't go wrong with this. Projection-wise, on this, you're going to get between two hours of projection. Very good. Not beast mode, but it's good projection. Longevity, you're going to probably get between six, maybe seven hours. Most people get about six hours, six and a half mark. It's a great fragrance overall. Can't go wrong with this fragrance here. And this is my number six, John Barbados, Artisan Pure. You can pick this fragrance up here at Macy's, Sephora, and Nordstrom, and you can pick it up online at some discounted sites for probably roughly about under about 60 bucks, but full price is about 69 for this bottle here. So we're going to jump into my number five. 4th of July fragrance coming right up. My number five 4th of July fragrance. This is a great fragrance. I made a lot of my summer and spring lists, but I'm going to get right to the fragrance. It's great. It's good for the summertime, springtime. You can wear it in the fall and winter too, but it's just great. You smell fresh and clean, and it's by the company Chanel, and it's no other than Blue Day Chanel Parfum. Can't go wrong a fragrance like this for the summertime, just for the 4th of July. It's just fresh. Like a fresh uh, shower gel, fresh out the shower, it's amazing. Distribution is good. Can't go wrong with this fragrance here. This is Blue Day Chanel, all the perfume. You can't go wrong with either one of the uh, Blue Day Chanel's, the original EDT or the perfume, the new version 2018. Either one of them are good. This one projects a little bit better. I enjoy this one, but I love the perfume one, but the perfume one is very close to the skin. This one is a little bit more, you can, you know, more out there. It's not projection beast, but it's a lot better than the projection on the perfume version. This is Blue Day Chanel Perfume. And if you haven't tried it, ladies and gentlemen, I don't know where you've been at, but you need to try this fragrance here, Blue Day Chanel Perfume. It's great. Fresh out the shower smell. Compliments. Women love this. Gravitate to it. Let's talk about projection wise. You're going to get two nice solid hours of projection. You're going to get between five to six hours of longevity on your skin. Can't go on with this fragrance here. And this is Blue Day Chanel Perfume. You can pick it up at Macy's, Sephora, Nordstrom, any Chanel boutique, online, eBay, list goes on and on. This is my number five, Blue Day Chanel, all the perfume. Now we're going to jump into my number four, 4th of July fragrance. So my number four, 4th of July fragrance, it's getting down to the wire pretty close, but this could have been number one, number two. I put it down below because it's on my list before and a lot of people do have this fragrance. I'm going to get right into it. It has your bergamot and broxen pepper it's just a fresh clean out the shower fragrance it's not a chanel fragrance ladies and gentlemen it's dior sauvage edt can't go wrong with dior sauvage edt you're in broxen bergamot pepper it's just amazing fragrance overall distribution this is a lady killer fragrance Girls love it, gravitate to it. They love the fragrance. Dior Sauvage has been out for almost three years now. One of the highest selling fragrances in the Dior line. It's great. 
Is it a crowd pleaser? Yes. Women love it? Yes. Projection wise, amazing. Longevity, amazing. You're going to get between two to three hours of strong projection with your Sauvage. And you're going to get longevity. You're going to get about six to eight hours, maybe eight hours plus on your skin. It depends on your skin chemistry with a lot of these fragrances. But so far, this will get you through an eight hour party or eight hour day out. And when you go out to 4th of July, you want to be able to have a fragrance that lasts, you know, within more than six to seven hours, even more than that. It depends on if you're going to be outside or inside. But my number four is your Sauvage EDT. You can pick up the Auto Perform too. They're both great. I put this one here because this one came out first. This is like more fresh. Just it's out there if you want to be the person out there, life of the party. And this is my number four, Dior Sauvage EDT. Now we're going to jump into my number three, 4th of July fragrance. My number three, 4th of July fragrance. I love this fragrance a lot. I talk about it on my channel a lot. You guys might be sick and tired of hearing about it, but it's the Irish fragrance by the House of Prada. I don't want to go into any more details. It's fresh out the shower, just like you did your clean linen or your laundry. The list goes on and on, but Prada alone. Great fragrance. You can wear this dressed up, dressed down. It's just fresh and clean out the shower. You may not want a BC mode performance fragrance. You just want something that is nice, that people get close to you, they smell it. You just want to feel fresh and clean at a 4th of July party, a gathering, an event, a festival, whatever you go to on 4th of July. You just want to smell fresh and clean and Prada alone, it's a great fragrance. You just spray it on and go. One, two, three, four, five. It smells amazing. Fresh out the shower smell. You can't go wrong with Prada alone. We the comments, you might get a few. You might not. This is a fragrance that people do like the smell of it. It's fresh and clean. You might get a lot of comments. You might get a little bit. Depends on you as a person, if you're outgoing, if you're not, if you're shy, if you like to be around people. It all depends on when you get compliments with fragrances. Some people don't talk about that on their channel, but they need to understand that. Just because you buy Dior Sauvage, Blue de Chanel, you're supposed to get compliments. No, it doesn't work that way. You need to dress the part. Look attractive. Look like you want to talk to people and be around people and enjoying your life. That's what people don't understand about fragrances. Just because you buy a fragrance doesn't mean you're going to get 50 million compliments the next day. It doesn't work that way. I've tried it. It doesn't work that way, ladies and gentlemen. But my number three is Prada Loam. Great fragrance. I get about two hours of projection. I get about five to six hours of longevity on my skin. It's great. If you want something fresh and clean, you don't want to be out there. You just want to... You want to just be fresh and clean for the day? Get Prada alone. My number three, 4th of July fragrance. Now we're going to jump into my number two, 4th of July fragrance. So my number two, 4th of July fragrance. It gets a lot of hate. People don't like it. I don't know why. I enjoy it. I love it. I should have bought a bigger bottle of it. If you don't know what I'm talking about, it's the Aqua Gigio. Absolute. I love this fragrance, Scott, ladies and gentlemen. It's a great fragrance. It's your fruity type of playful, young kind of vibe. You can be a mature person, young person with this fragrance. I enjoy it a lot. I hype it up on my channel. I know people don't believe the hype, but you need to actually go out and try this fragrance. Not everybody's going to like this fragrance, maybe not, but a lot of people do like it. I've got many comments we've received with this fragrance here. I enjoy wearing it. Can't go wrong with it. I just, I love the bottle presentation itself. Clear with the juice. I love the wooden cap up top. It doesn't matter that, it just snaps on. I like the presentation. There's the batch code on the bottom for you guys if you want to check that out. It's just overall beautiful. I love it. Just a fruity, great, pleasant fragrance. You're going to get about two hours of projection. Very nice. Longevity, you're going to get probably between six hours, maybe seven hours. It all depends on your skin chemistry. Sometimes I get, um, how, can I, how, how can I talk about it? Old factory tea where people do smell it after like eight or nine hours. I don't smell it anymore, but that's awesome. Great fragrance. You can't go wrong with this. And this is my number two, Fourth of July fragrance, Aqua de Gio Absolute. Now we're gonna jump into my number one, Fourth of July fragrance. So stay tuned. My number one, Fourth of July fragrance. It's blue. I enjoy it. I wish the projection was a lot better than what it was, but it is good for the summertime slash spring. I talked that on my channel a little bit. I have a review on it in the bottom if you want to check it out and I have an unboxing of it. I'm going to get right to it, ladies and gentlemen. <sighs> Here we go. Invictus Aqua 2018. This fragrance is great. It has the blue, just like the 4th of July. Ah, it's a little bit light, but it works. It's a beautiful, fresh, 
ocean type of fragrance. It smells like you're just relaxing on the beach. It's amazing. That's what I get from my nose. Everybody, everybody knows can be different. I enjoy it. Fresh, fruity, just it's a pleasant fragrance, fresh. People will gravitate to it and like it. I haven't found one person that did not like this fragrance. Invictus Aqua 2018. I enjoy it. Projection wise, I get about an hour and a half. It's pretty good, not the best, but it's above average. Better than most fragrances out there. Longevity wise, you're gonna get about five to six hours. It's great. I like the color of it, I like the bottle presentation, like you're a champion. It's great. Distribution's good. It's great. If you're looking for a nice spring summer fragrance or a 4th of July fragrance, this is nice. You can pick this up at Nordstrom, Safari, Macy's. They all have it. You can get this for under about 60 bucks, 67 bucks exactly. Or you can find on discounts probably for about 60 to 55 bucks. It's great. I enjoy it. The presentation is amazing. The batch code on the bottom information. The box of Invictus on top. Put it this way. Just amazing. Distribution is amazing. The back has Paco Rabanne. It's just I enjoy this fragrance a lot, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoy my fragrance list. It is only my six fragrances that I think 4th of July would be nice. There's probably a lot more. If you see other, other fragrances that you think are better for 4th of July, leave a comment below. It's just my list. Everybody's list is going to be different. Uh, Mr. Siaj, I tag you to do your top 4th of July fragrance list. If you have time, great. If you don't, it's no problem. I'd like to give a shout out to Mr. Siaj. His real name's Chris. He's a great YouTuber. He does fragrance reviews too. He's awesome, man. I don't, I don't live too far from him. I got to meet up with him and grab something to eat and just talk about Ferguson's in life. But hey, I appreciate you, you man, you know, what you're doing on your channel. And I'll leave a link below to his channel. You can check him out. He's a great guy. All positive every time I talk to him. So you guys take care. Like this video. Share the video. And please consider subscribing if you like men's fragrances, unboxings, and free decans. Have a nice 4th of July. Peace.